but we're still learning about the ocean's creatures every single day. Even though they're supposed to live many meters below the water, sometimes they seem to venture too close to the shore and we get to greet them firsthand. Today we're showing you 10 sea creatures that wound up in the strangest places. You've already washed up at the hub, so why not make the most of your visit and click the subscribe button before we begin. Goose Barnacles when locals first spotted this creature with its shell-like appendages attached to jelly-like tentacles, they had no idea what it was. Unlike any fish or sea creature spotted in this part of town before, it was left to experts to identify. It washed up at shore on a Devon beach in England and was eventually identified as goose barnacles. It seems they usually attach themselves to floating items such as seaweed, wood, or rubbish when there's a storm nearby. Indonesian Beach Creature if you saw this giant, 15 meter long carcass at your local beach, how would you react? The unknown creature seemingly died at sea and got pushed onto the beach when the tide went out. Locals first thought it was a boat due to its huge size, and some are still speculating whether it's the remains of a whale or even a mythical giant squid. Even scarier was the fact that as the unknown creature decayed, it started to turn the surrounding water bright red. Hebrides Blob at 3.7 meters long, the Hebrides blob must have been a scary sight for Louise Witz, who discovered the washed up animal on a beach in the Hebrides in Scotland. She described the creature as having eaten away flesh or even furry skin with fin-like shapes along its back. Scientists thought it sounded like a ragworm, those only grow to a few inches long. Either way, no one was sure what it was or why it had washed up in Scotland of all places. Velola Velola these jellyfish are pretty common to see in the ocean, and it's not too rare if one or two washes up, but it was something of a shock when thousands of them washed up on a beach in Oregon. They're commonly known by the wind sailors and usually skim the surface of the ocean to get by. Their namesake comes from the fact that they follow the wind wherever it goes, hence why so many seem to favor one particular beach at one point. A post-earthquake visit. After a huge earthquake struck the Philippines, weird things started washing up on the beaches. One particularly strange occurrence was the arrival of a huge furry white creature. Scientists think that animals are somehow able to predict natural disasters and swim in a certain direction as a result. While some presumed it was a carcass of a whale, no one was truly sure just what this strange washed up creature could be. However, instead of being scared of the beast, locals took the chance to take selfies nearby. Sea Messengers and that creature wasn't the only one to pay a visit to the Philippines. More than seven oarfish washed up on beaches around the time of the earthquake. Rarely seen, the oarfish tends to live more than a thousand meters under the water, making it a rare visitor to grace the sand. But now it's happened so frequently that people have dubbed the creature the sea messenger, which can sense when the weather is getting dangerous and moves around accordingly. As it was so strange to see a group of oarfish at once, the news spread quickly. Welsh Dolphins A man and his dog were on an innocent morning stroll in Wales when they came across a washed up dolphin. Luckily, the dog walker knew exactly what to do and kept the poor creature wet while the animal rescue team set off to assist. Even though it happened at 6 a.m., everyone who walked past stopped to help, showing that there's still some faith in humanity when it comes to helping out these washed up animals. Thankfully, the dolphin was returned to sea and seems to be happy and healthy. The Shark Swimming Pool while seeing a dolphin on the shore might seem cute and innocent, it's a whole other story if you happen to bump into a great white shark. But when one accidentally ended up on a beach in Sydney, Australia, locals took it to a nearby rock pool so it could stay in a healthy environment while they figured out what happened. It seemed to have an injured mouth, but it was fine once it was rescued on a stretcher. As much as we're glad to hear of this happy ending, we wouldn't want to have been too close. Fangtooth Snake Eel if the name of this creature doesn't put you off, then its looks might do. The strangest part of this occurrence is that the unknown creature washed up in the unlikeliest of places, Texas. Sadly, by the time it washed up on the beach, it was deceased, making it difficult for scientists to distinguish between a few different types of eel. What it lacked in a proper face, it more than made up for in huge sharp teeth. This is definitely one washed up creature we'd love to learn more about, because it remains unknown as to what it actually was. The Canvey Island Monster. Okay, so this creature turned out to not actually be a monster after all, but you'd be forgiven for thinking it was. With its huge mouth and enough fangs to swallow us whole, it's fair to say we'd be spooked to see this washed up at shore. It was found on Canvey's beach in 1953, and then again as a larger version in 1954. While scientists were convinced it was a monkfish, some of its features suggested otherwise. Seems we'll never know for sure. We'll definitely be taking a second glance at the shore next time we're wandering around by the ocean. We hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time.